What is going on, everybody? It is your boy, Jonathan the Gamer Dude, here, welcoming you to Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony. In the last episode, there were some shenanigans going on, and it was, like, wacky, and there, yeah. You guys need to see it, because, oh my god, Kaido out here, one, scaring me, two, doing things that he shouldn't be doing. So, we're gonna talk to him first, because, oh my god, guy, you need to calm yourself. I mean... Don't do anything stupid, alright, guys? So, I'll do something about this. I just don't know what yet. Damn. But I'll definitely do something about it. We don't have a plan either. And I want to trust him, but he doesn't seem too reliable. Exactly. He's not. He's being very sussy. Kurumi. Um, hey, Kurumi. What do you think we should do? That is troubling. It seems we still, must, we still must find a clue before we can begin cooperating with one another. But even if we manage to do that, we are still trapped here. Uh, Jeez. All we can do is wait around for the killing game to start. I do not agree. No. I do not think that the killing game, or the start of the killing, wow, hold on. No, I do not think that would start the killing game. People cannot kill others so easily, especially when they when they harbor no malice. Even when one's life is in danger, it is quite difficult to follow through with an act of it, uh, the act itself. Facts. So, Shuichi. Um. Hey, Shuichi. What should we do right now? I'm... We need to move. Huh? Huh, move. Shuichi slowly approached me, as if wary of his surroundings, and said in a hushed voice, well, that's... This morning, before I came to the dining hall, I just noticed the dust cleared from the card reader on the floor. Huh? You mean the library? Uh, okay. Yes. So, he, he, when he said he needed to move, he was hinting at something. If that's the case, then... Shuichi. Shuichi, I can help you in any... Can I help you in any way? Uh, of okay. course, Kayede. But we should go. We shouldn't keep talking like this in the open. What's the matter? What's up with you guys? What are you whispering about? We're not whispering. We're just gonna check on something. Hmm. Huh. And that thing you want to check is a secret, huh? Um. Sorry. All I can say is... Yeah. I haven't given up. I'll show you guys that we can escape from this place. You can count on it. I believe I in see. you. I see. Well, if that's how it is, then I believe in you. Yeah. Thanks. It's not like... Uh, it's not like me to give up anyway. I've talked and believed that my wishes can come true if I just worked hard enough. That's... You know what? I'm sorry, other peeps. I wanted to talk to you guys, but Shuichi brings up a good point, and we're going to the library, right? The frick now. Hey. Hey, are we heading to the library? I suppose so. Yes. I'll tell you everything there. Beep boop. Running to the library. Oh, wait. Did Is I... that all right? Kaede, we should go to the library. I'll tell you everything there. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I... I realized it as soon as I did it that I went the wrong way. Don't worry. I'm not a dumb. I realized that we have to go this way. <laughs> but hey, I was close-ish. Like, you gotta give me credit for that, Shuichi. Cl uh, close is not good, but... Beautiful hey. lie. All right. I'll explain everything. First, take a look at the card reader. As Shuichi said it, that he moved back the bookcase and revealed the hidden door. Ramble, 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 ramble. I peeked into the gap of the card reader. Uh, the dust is gone. I'm... That's right. I checked it right after nighttime started yesterday, and the dust was there. In the morning, it was uh, gone. So that means somebody went and entered the door during the nighttime. Could it be? That got me thinking. This may sound far-fetched, but... Perhaps Monokuma's revival is related to the door, this door somehow. Huh? How so? If I remember correctly. Remember what Monoku what the Monokum said? This school has a machine somewhere that make can make a whole lot of pops. Just activate that machine and you can have as many spare pops as you want. Hmm. Um, so there's a machine that can rebuild the spare Monokuma. Because... That would explain why we saw Monokuma alive and well this morning. At nighttime, someone went through this door and activated the machine. And then, that's when Mon what Monokuma just told us. A time limit will now be in effect if the murder does not occur by nighttime two days from now. Every student forced to participate in this killing game will die. I knew it. The way he phrased it seemed peculiar. Why not just say everyone will die? He went out of his way to specify that students forced to participate will die. Um. But why? That's true. My deduction is that one of us volunteered to participate and wasn't forced. That would mean that they would avoid execution without breaking any rules. 
Perhaps that's why Madakuma said it that way. Huh? And the person is the one in our group who's cooperating with Madakuma. That's... And I don't know if Madakuma is that strict with the rules, but if he's trying to protect someone, that would imply that they're doing much more than just cooperating with Madakuma. Huh? Because... I believe that if one of us is to create can create spare Madakumas, that they are the mastermind behind this killing game. Um... So a person who's responsible for all of our suffering is one of us? Uh... Okay. Of course, this is just what I've deducted, but it is entirely possible. That is why I didn't want to talk to you about this in front of everyone. If we told them now, we they might all try to find the master ride and it would lead to murder. Mm. But that's why I can tell only tell you, Kaede. The mastermind. The one controlling Monokuma. I can't believe a person responsible for suffering could be among us. It's hard to accept it, but if it's true, I cannot forgive them. Hey. So what is your plan now, Shuichi? We're gonna go find the Mastermind, right? I'm... I'm thinking of taking a risk before time expires. I believe the Mastermind will come here just before time is up, and I can expose huh? them. Wait, so how do you know they're gonna come up here before time's up? That's... I'm extrapolating from something Monokuma told us earlier. Mauled the shreds by countless Monokumas and the rumored Monokuma making machine! Hmm. To produce a large number of Monokumas, the Mastermind would have to come here. They would have to get into a hidden room to activate the machine. Well. Of course, none of this is certain. There's a chance the Master Iron won't show. Like I said, it is a risk. But, but I am willing to take it. It's better than just sitting around waiting to I die. See. Yeah. Oh, right. I'll take that risk with you. But, but Kayede, this is just my deduction. It is possible that I am wrong. Of course. Yeah, I know. But I've made up my mind. You told me about this, so it must mean you trust me, right, Shuichi? Yeah. Then I will trust you too. You know? I mean... I don't have a good idea of my own on my own, so obviously I will help you with yours. Mm -hmm. Okay then, let's expose the mastermind together, Shuichi. Thank you, Thank you Kayede. You have a way of encouraging me. Mm. I never expected this to happen, though. I can't believe our enemies are within the group hiding in plain sight. Uh, okay. Yeah. Aww. Now that we know this, I should stop saying everyone needs to work together. Oh right. But whoever is the mastermind, we'll expose them. I can help and help everyone ex else escape. When. This is all behind us. We're gonna stay good friends, I promise, okay? Okay. Right. After we reapplied the dust to the car, I left Shuichi and returned to my room. Crap, that means we're not gonna be able to talk to Kuichi, or, or Kuichi, whoa. Pfft. Suichi, if we have... Uh... Yes, okay, free time. We're not gonna be able to talk to Shuichi, are we? Crap. Well, at the Academy, you have free time every now and then. During free time, you can spend time with others and strengthen your bond with them. You can also give them a present to strengthen their bonds further. You can buy presents at the Mana Mana Machine. If your bond gets strong enough, an intimate event might occur. Nice. But if you don't have free time forever, spending time with someone passes the time. You can also end free time by going straight to bed yourself. That is, I mean, I wouldn't skip it if I, if, but if you'd rather be alone, that's cool too. We're not being alone. So... Mm. I want to test Shuichi first. Also, we need to go to a mono mono machine. We don't have coins, though. I don't think we have coins, anyway. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Yeah, we got no coins. What the heck? Well, I guess we can't get some presents first. No presents for us. Although we've been into the dining hall a couple times, so maybe there's a Monokuma there. Hi, Kaido. No. Crap. Okay. Well, um, hmm. With that being said, let's go downstairs to the library and see if by happenstance we can talk to Shuiji, but I don't really know if we're going to be able to. And if we're not able to talk to Shuiji, I do have a backup plan at least, but still. 
I would like to not have to enact it. And, and of course, I'm not going to double talk to somebody yet. This is too early, and I like the cast to do that. Like, this cast is amazing so far. And so, yeah, double talking to people was, especially in the second game, was more about, I like this certain group of people. Oh, Rantaro's here. That's not what I expected. Rantaro is somebody that's interesting to me, too. To be fair, Rantaro I could talk to probably and be fine with. Kibo's in the game room. Kibo would be cool. Ah, this is what I've been looking for the entire time. Okay. Oh, should we choose the warehouse? Buddy! Why are you in the warehouse? I didn't think you'd be in there. I expected Miu to be there, which is another character I want to talk to. There's so many characters that I want to talk to. It's going to be difficult. My first free time event. That's true. By the way, there's a lot of weird things around here. Maybe we should investigate more. Should I spend time with Suichi? Yes, we should. I'm just really curious. I don't think that there's... Uh, they'd be there for no reason. You really should help me out, Kayede. I'd like to hear from different perspectives. I spent time with searching around with the school with Shuichi. Shuichi and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Shuichi a present? I wish I could. What? No, no, no. No. What? Oh, we have a present? Oh, it's just a badge. Never mind. What? What? Okay. What the fuck, game? What the actual fuck, game? I don't have money for presents! I might as well skip the damn free time! There's nothing I can do! Frick, you know what? Yeah, we might as well. Hey, Kyo, you want to talk? You're right here. I see, yes. Huh. It seems like I'll be able to see a clearer picture of human beauty than ever before. Should I spend time with Kyo? Sure, why not? Honestly. <laughs> then I will tell you about the beauty of humanity I've witnessed so far. Yeah, Kyo, we're going to talk. Spend time with Kyo, who listened to me talk to me, or talk to me about investigating the school. Kyo and I grew a little closer today. Sure, 100%. We don't have a present for you. At all. Here, you want to have this? Might as well. No, I'm joking. I, I, I don't have presents. So they don't get the hope fragments. Like what? Like, honestly, like what? What was... This is the visual announcement from the Ultimate Academy. So, so you can see Monica is had a little bit too much honey. Oh, really, really happy about Daddy's return. Yeah. Now let's play darts, Monodom. Can be the dart board. And let's go bowling. Monodom can be the ball. Yeah, but... By the way, which announcement were we making? Oh. The night team announcement, hmm? silly. What? It's already too late. I should go to bed soon. Bedtimer sign. I feel like that free time was kind of useless at this rate the time limit will expire before we know it yeah like i didn't actually get to have free time with them what but i won't lose i won't give up because i want to see everyone smile just a little longer i want to spend time with them laughing and talking about normal teenagers so i won't give up like i'll teach you guys how to win over a lady First, you gotta give her a present. Ladies can't resist presents. 
But you can't give her any present. There's gotta be presents suited for her tastes. And that's gotta be a handmade present too. So it looks like you put it, to or put it together on it. For example, the kind of lady who's into strong men would love a handmade pro wrestling group. She'll love being surrounded by macho dudes. And you'll make money off the wrestlers too. If enough wrestlers get popular, then it would, might be good to host a big event. After they're done beating up each other, they can go fight other pro wrestler groups. Just give it a shot, and I'm positive you'll win her heart. Rise and shine, or shine. Monodom is drunk AF. Or not Monodom, Monikid is drunk AF. This is an announcement. From the Hope Ultimate Academy. Now oh. eight eight. Jeez, Mono Kid really drank too much honey. How long is he gonna keep sleeping? Ah. Oh boy. Father's time that expires at 10 p.m. tomorrow so night. Long. Farewell. Time that ends tomorrow. Suichi is gambling on that. Which means we have to watch the library while the time is running out. Shouldn't we start preparing? I'm getting worried. Uh. Oh, Suichi. Perfect timing. Shuichi, I wanted to ask you something, but as soon as I answered the door... Oh, too bad! It's me! It hurts my heart to be screamed at by a young girl. But it hurts all the good and all the same. What do you want? Uh, I figured I'd come let you know that some of the research labs are open. You mean the ultimate research labs? Those classrooms tailored to the 16 talents? Yeah, your lab is finally all set up, so you can go whenever you want. Now go to the ultimate pianist's lab right away and compose a murderous melody. A murderous melody? What are you even talking about? So, um, are you going to invite me inside for tea or what? Oh, no, of course not. I slammed the door on Monokuma's face with all of my might. Jeez, that was super annoying. Jeez. God, how annoying. This is probably Shuichi. Jeez. Jeez, enough already. You're already bothering me. It's Shuichi. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Should I come back later? Like, uh, this man gets brutally attacked for no reason. This poor man. Uh. Oh, Shuichi. Sorry. I just ignored what I said. Um. I wanted to talk to you, Shuichi. I was wondering if we needed to do anything for the plan. Uh, um. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. I might know how to keep watch on the library. Huh? Weren't we planning on hiding inside the library and keeping watch from there? Hmm. If we did that, we'd risk the mastermind running into us. It's safe for if we watch from further away. Hmm. We also need hard evidence to convince everyone that the mastermind's identity. So that's why I thought it would be a good idea to set up some cameras. Um, cameras? Okay. I found some cameras in the security sensors in the warehouse. And some modification we can do to combine the two. And with the cameras, we can detect the movement and take pictures. If we set up a few in the library, we can capture proof of the mastermind. And we don't have to see the library for this to work. So it's less likely to get caught. I see. That's a really good idea. But do you know how to modify a camera? Ah, oh, well, I don't know how. That's why I wanted to ask Miu, the ultimate inventor, to help us. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's true. But she's pretty intimidating, so I'm going to have trouble asking her myself. That's right. Oh, in that case, we should ask her together. Uh, um... I saw Miu headed to the tiny hall. I think that she's still going to be there. Is that all right? But um, we should be careful about what we tell her. She might be it. She might be it. As in Miu might be the mastermind. I doubt it, but... Yeah. Well, if that's what you think. We'll go to the dining hall. Dining hall. Duh, the dining hall. Heading to the dining hall right now. We're going to do it. Also, I'm not trying to fast travel very much, so the last fast travel for- I'm, The only time I really will, I think, fast travel is for free time purposes, because I want to get to places and want to talk to people I want to talk to. But I'm a- I, I, Again, I am a little distraught by the fact that free time went the way that it went, because, like, I was hoping that I'd be able to actually, you know, rank up these dang characters, because, again, I care about them a lot, and so not being able to rank them up was kind of upsetting. But I'm assuming that's because I didn't have presents and didn't get good on the Monokubas, and that's my own damn fault, but... Hey, Miu. Miu is sitting down, looking at her usual... Or looking at her usual hottie self. Seems like she's alone. Hi, Miu. Hey. Morning, Miu. Well, but isn't that flash-chested Kiate... Or, uh, Kaede? What do you and your pathetic tits want? 
I'll just pretend I didn't hear that. Um, I have a small favor to ask you, Miu, right, Suichi? You're right. Yeah, actually, there's something we want you to make. We found cameras and security sensors in the warehouse, and, uh, do you think you can make us a camera that detects movement and takes pictures? As in, it would automatically take a picture if a motion sensor detects something? Huh? The hell are you gonna use that for? Uh, um, um, to keep Monokuma under surveillance, we might learn an important information. Yeah, yeah exactly that. Please, Miu. We need to help you. Your help to get everyone out of here. Oh, oh I okay. See. I get it now. Bitch. My answer's no. Huh? What? You know. You plebs got a lot of nerve asking me for a favor. <laughs> you were grubs in the past life, and that's why you don't understand the basic human courtesy. Fuck all y'all. I'll forgive you with just this one, but now you gotta, I gotta get out of here before I whip you out the bug spray. <laughs> Without thinking, my body moved on its own. Oh, are we gonna slap her? Oh, we're Please getting on our knees. Mew. We're getting on our knees. Okay. I really want to get out of here with everyone. And to do that, I need your help. So, please, I'm begging you. Kaede. Shuichi? <laughs> Shuichi's on his knees now, too. I'm begging you, too. You could really <laughs> use your help, Mew. Please? What the hell? Quit bowing to me. No, I won't stop. I'm gonna stay like this until you say you'll do it, Miu. I'll do it for however long it takes. Who the hell uses bowing as a threat? F fine, I'll do it, okay? What? Really? I grasped Miu's hand. <laughs> mm-hmm. Thank you. I owe you. Even after we escape, I'll owe you forever and ever. I, I am not doing this know. for you guys. My research lab is in the garden. I just opened it up, so I was already thinking about checking it out. Uh, so, I can I have my hand back now? Because I'm starting to. It's, this is starting to creep me out. Uh, oh, sorry. I was just so happy. Hmm. But your hands are always. Are your hands always this clammy? Uh, uh, anyway, bring me the security sensors and the cameras before I change my mind. I'll be waiting in my research lab in the garden. Miu wobbled out of the dining hall as if she had been thrown off balance. Thank God. I'm glad we managed to convince her. Then, Let's go to the warehouse and get the sensors, or get the cameras and sensors right away. Okay. Like, there's so much. It's crazy how much is going on, but, like, also how much isn't going on in this episode. Like, we're getting a lot of plot movement, but it's, yeah, I, like I said, this is crazy to me. Uh, this place is huge. I hope we can find what things we're looking for. That's. Oh, don't worry. I know where the camera sensors are. I'll go get them. You can wait here. Oh, are you sure? Yes, uh, Shuichi. Uh, after he said that, Shuichi walked to the back of the warehouse. What? A high jump bar. Cool, I guess. Doesn't matter, though, because we're, get we're getting out of this place. I guess we'll have to wait for Suichi, then. Yes. Shot put balls. Oh, wooden balls. Oh, these are iron balls. They look like a shot put, but I picked one up to see how heavy it looked, and it was... The athletes who have to hurl these things are pretty impressive. Hmm. Kaede, what are you doing? Uh, oh, Shuichi, done already. Okay. Yeah, got the cameras. I think three should be enough. Huh? Disposable camera. Will this work? Uh, um. Um, that's all they had, but they work, so should be just fine. These also, there's also a photo developing solution in here. We don't have to worry about that. Hmm. Well, if you're fine with them. Well. Yeah, three cameras should be okay. Also, here's the security sensor. The sensor picks up movement. It triggers this receiver to make a sound. We should be get three of these as well. I see. As huge as this warehouse is, I didn't expect to have security sensors in stock. Uh, oh, do you want me to carry the cameras? I can put it in my backpack. I only have musical sheets in here and a spare vest, so there's a lot of room inside. Then... All right, let's go talk to Miu. As we took three disposable cameras from Suhiji, I suddenly stopped. Will these cameras really work? Even if we take pictures of the mastermind and persuade everyone, 
what will we do after that? The mastermind could just smirk and order the exiles to attack everyone. Exocils to attack everyone. Can we really protect everyone from this plan? Will we really be able to escape this place? Hmm. Kayene, is something wrong? We need to go before Miu changes her mind. Suichi, Suichi was already at the door of the warehouse waiting for me. Uh. Oh, sorry. I shoved the things I was holding into my backpack and ran after him. Then, all right, let's see Miu's lab. Let's go to Miu's lab. I saw it in the courtyard. I see. Oh, you mean that large building in the garden at the bottom of the stairs? Hmm. hmm. Up till now, our research labs have been just normal classrooms. Well, well, seems all right, doesn't it? Running to the courtyard again. <laughs> I feel like we keep going to like the same spots. I don't know. Is that just me? Like I feel like it's like, oh, you're going back outside, by the way. Like, you're gonna go back outside again, by the way. Oh yeah, you're gonna go back outside. Oh hi. Hold on. I need to talk to Angie. Oh, there's three people here. Come on, come on. Good morning, good morning to you both. Spending time together again. Yeah, we are. Hi, Tenko. Uh, Kayene, say something to her. Um, huh, what's going on? Mm -hmm. Angie's trying to brainwash me and Himoko with the Atua nonsense. But, but... Brainwash? I'm just answering Himiko's questions about Atua. What? what are you saying of Himiko's of all people? Believes in Atua over magic? Well, both are hard to believe. It'll be okay. I don't believe in him. It's just strange that me and Angie isn't afraid of time tomorrow's time limit. Yeah. Because Atua already has welcomed me into his kingdom. What is this? Shut up about Atua! Your god is not gonna get us out of the situation! Huh? huh? You don't believe Tenko? Piece of cake. The only thing I believe in is Akito. I see. Huh. I see. What about you, Himiko? Because I'm a mage. I'm a mage. I do not lean or learn any priest spells. I see, I see. I see, I see. Well, I suppose that's okay for now. Atua is a merciful god. He forgives everyone, even though who did not believe. But, but... And any non-believers always come around eventually. So divine! Because Atua is always with me. <laughs> How divine. I... Why, you? I will not be deceived by your words. <gasps> Nor will Himiko either. What a pain. Um, believing in Atua sounds like it would be too much of a pain. That's your reason? It's Neo Aikido. Himiko should be... You should believe in Akita over Atua. What a or Atua. pain. That's a pain, too. Himiko. I'm sleepy. I shouldn't I couldn't sleep well last night. I took all it took all my courage just to use the restroom. But I guess people can overcome their fears when they were really forced to, so she was holding it in. Hey, it happens. It truly happens. No shame, not. Heck, sometimes you hold it in when you just need to go to the bathroom and you don't want to because your bed's so comfy. Um, the Shrine of Judgment. Let's give her the cameras and sensors before she gets in a bad mood. All right, let's go to Miu's lab. I saw it in the courtyard. Oh, I'm dumb, apparently. Her lab must be this. Yes. The Ultimate Inventor's Lab. Knock, knock. Right after it knocked, the door violently swung open. Trashy You're skank. fucking late. How dare you waste precious seconds of my time? Oh, it looks like she's back to normal. Fuck all well, don't you go to my golden brain waiting, or why well, don't keep my golden brain waiting? Give me what you got. Uh, okay, I just got these, but I took the cameras out from my backpack and handed them to me. What was that? Uh, disposable cameras. Are you disposable? Are disposable cameras too difficult for you to modify? Huh? Huh? Do you ask bird watchers if they know how to gawk at a dumbass birds? Of course I can do a piece of cake. Man. Ah, here are the security monitors then. Oh. Oh, so you want me to take these sensors, make the cameras to take pictures automatically, right? Uh, I was thinking the camera could be triggered by the security sensor. As the sensor detects movement and the receiver goes off and the shutter activates. That's how I would like it to work if possible. After I heard that, I whispered into Suiji's ear. Um, what are you going to use that for? That's... I'm going to move... Or I'm going to set them up on the moving bookcase. That's why we can keep watch from anywhere as long as we have the receiver with us. If someone moves the bookcase, the receiver will just let us know, right? And the camera connected to the sensor will take a picture of whoever moved the bookcase. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. You mother What are you two whispering about? No. Nothing. Is that all right? I wrote down the details here. Hmm. 
two cameras with built-in security sensors. That'll take photos automatically. And a third camera that will trigger the sensor in the receiver as it automatically takes the photo? Sure. How soon do you need these? Uh, um, Should you make them by tomorrow morning? Shut up! Of course I can! You can tie me up and drip me with hot or drip hot wax in me and I'll finish in no time. With that bold declaration, Mew slammed the door in our faces. Mm. Did she reveal some sort of kinks to us? Then anyway. <laughs> it's Mew, what do you expect? I think this is we'll do it. We just have to wait till for Mew to finish. Um Kayede, what's wrong? No. Nothing. It's just Thinking about how amazing you are for coming up with this plan, Shuichi. Huh? What? You know? Honestly, when I first met you, I didn't think that you would be that reliable. <laughs> but look at me now, relying on you like you're Sherlock Holmes or something. Uh, okay. Yeah. We are giving so much spotlight to sh uh, freaking Shuichi, I'm scared. We went to our separate rays and returned to our rooms. For more free time. Probably not, but maybe, possibly. Because free time is short anyways. Time load is nighttime. Today is my last task to go around. I'm sure I need to, don't forget to do anything important. Yeah, okay, so more free time. With no money. Like, am I just idiot? Or am I just an idiot? And I'm overthinking it? Probably. Honestly, gamer overthinks things? No way. It could never happen. What? I'm gonna talk to Keo again because I would rather risk messing up things with Keo than messing up things with Shuichi to be completely honest Kyo's not on this floor there's Kyo Kyo well I get to level one with you now because I don't have any mono coins do I Scares me. Kyo. <sighs> oh. May I help you? Should I spend time with Kyo? Yes, because I, I really hope I can get to level one with Kyo. Well then. Well, may I listen to some music in your lab? I spent time talking or talking about music with Kyo. Kyo and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Kyo a present? I can't! I don't have the money. Like, what? Listen. So, Kaede, you are the ultimate pianist to get right. Oh, we are gonna oh, we are gonna rank! Okay! 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 Okay, I feel better. Oh my god. Okay, my oh god, I was just overthinking. Thank god. It might be accelerated if I have presents. It that that's probably what it is. It might be accelerating if I have presents, but if I don't have, ah, thank God. Okay, Kayede, you're the ultimate pianist, correct? What's the matter? Yeah, what about it? No. Well, music is an important aspect of anthropology. I see. Oh, that's true. Like folk music. Oh. That kind of folk music you are likely imagining is different from the, my field of study, though. Um. How different? Do you understand? When you think of Japanese folk music, what comes to mind? Hmm. Uh, I guess the Japanese court music, like the koto or the flute, or music that's played during New Year's. I see. Yes. Correct. In those examples of traditional cultural music of Japan. However, what I research is music created through the people's daily lives. Um, what do you mean? Let's see. Huh. How to put it? It is complicated distinction, I admit. It's music that was not crafted by the hands of specialists such as musicians. You see. Nursery rhymes, lullabies, songs passed down through generations of mothers, traditions and events expressed in a song, such as a song to remember a disaster. Yes, things mm -hmm. like that. I see. I kind of get what you mean. Though. Listen. There are many nursery rhymes and children games whose meanings have been forgotten. But such the meaning of anthropologist's chase, I can tell you the one if you'd like. There's a song called Going Home. Um. There's a song called Going Home. I thought it was a folk song, but it was actually just Dvork's New World Sympathy with the lyrics. Mm. Uh, so you are familiar with it after all, yes. Sympathy number, or sympathy, or symphony, I can't word vomit. 
Symphony, <laughs> Symphony Number no. Nine, Second Movement, known as in Japan as Sunset on a Far Off Mountain. You know? I almost feel like I'm floating when I listen to it. The lyrics are paired nicely with it too. I see. But I never thought it would have been. I thought you'd study children's nursery rhymes of all things. Well. Um, this shows how intertwined music has become with our daily lives. That's right. Yeah, it just means that music has always been with humanity, even way back then. <laughs> Such words of a s seem simple, yet they may have a profound meaning behind them. Oh, I feel so much better now that we have a hope fragment with Kiyo! Actually, like, I like the study of anthropology, like, honestly. So, like, that, again, I kind of get Kyo a little bit. Parting ways with Kyo, I return to my room. Oh, I feel so much better. Jeez, Louise. I wonder if we're going to get a lot more free time and that's why it's doing this, or we really just got to get a hidden Monokuma and just start boom, giving presents because we just don't have the money for them right now. Oh, Kibo's right there. No, we need we need to get our we need to get our one with uh we do need to get our one with uh Shuiji. Shuiji Where what? Where My Oh there he is. He's in the classroom. I was like, where'd you go? Shuiji. Oh, Gontha's right there too. But if I need to get, if I need to talk to people twice in order to get health fragments, then I guess we're doubling both of them. And you know how I said, screw it, I guess we're talking to Kyo. It's not like I didn't want to talk to Kyo in that moment. Like, but he was also right there. And I do like actually care about Kyo, so it's fine. That's why I did it, by the way. It's not that I was like, fine, fuck it. I like free time. I'm not that. I just just want to say that and clarify that. it is. I am not doing it because I don't want to talk to Kyo. I actually did want to talk to Kyo. I was like, fuck it, you're right here. We're talking to you now. <laughs> just needed to make sure that I clarified that because I, I feel like it did come across as like, uh, God damn it. Now we're just going to talk to you instead and get this free time over with. It's like, no, I like free time. Free time in this game is actually one of my favorite parts of the game. So... Yeah. <laughs> There's a whole day left, but I'm starting to get nervous. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. What did I do? Why did I hit no? Excuse me. Yes, we're spending time sorry. with Shuichi. Oh, I'm sorry. I said something so pathetic. I'll drink some tea and try and calm down. I spent some time drinking tea with Shuichi. Shuichi. Shuichi and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Shuichi a present? No, because I don't have any. Shuichi. Shuichi, what does the ultimate detective like you do most of the time? Huh? Huh? What do I do? Hey. Do you wear a cap, smoke a pipe, or use a magnifying glass to investigate crime scenes? Do you stuff like that? Do, do you say stuff like that? Indeed, most intriguing. <laughs> you know, that sort of thing. Hey. Um, I'm not old enough to smoke a pipe. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's pretty classic old-fashioned detective look. Is pretty outdated, huh? I suppose so. Yeah, I don't do much investigating either. Um, really? What kind of cases do you get? Do you spend most of your time doing nothing? No. No, actually. My uncle's detective office is actually fairly popular, so we receive lots of cases. But... A lot of those cases are small jobs. Identify our infidelity cases, background checks. Infidelity cases sound intense. Huh? Infidelity cases sound intense. Well... Yeah, honestly, at times when it gets... It, there are times where it gets pretty hard. I'm sure he's seen pretty rough things then. Hey. Are you all right, Suichi? You're not worried about... by, Or you're not worried... You weirded out by romance or women, right? Well... Ah, uh, no. Uh, oh. And just because you see that it happen a lot, it doesn't mean cheating is okay. Huh? Never, never. I would never do something dishonest. Suichi's frantically shaking his head. Yeah, he doesn't seem like the type that would do that. Hey. In other cases... Do you get uh, what other um, cases do you get some other cases i get are stuff like finding runaways and stuff uh, oh that could be even bigger an even hey. bigger case uh, i'm sorry to disappoint you but those cases are rarely connected to crimes it's my job to find them before it comes to that but and after they're found that's the hard part um, after they're found okay 
It's necessary to follow up with both Client and the Runaway to make sure it all is well. Hmm. Detectives have to follow up with them well. too. Well, perhaps not all detectives, but that's my uncle's policy. And that's a policy that I agree with. People have reasons for running away, so the case is only closed when the po all parties are that's happy. Right. That's true. If you don't take care of the problem, they'll probably obviously just try and run away again. I didn't know what detectives how are were so considerate, or is Suichi just a special case? Call fragment. I ha I should be I should be correct on that though. Like once I get once I get coins and once I'm able to get presents, then I should be able to rank them up faster. But because I didn't find any of the like stuff that I can't. is an announcement it is now 10 p.m one of y'all bastards might have your last night time ever no don't say something so violent to, to start do don't do something violent to start the killing camp you can make it one more night oh i get it now i totally get it it's crystal clear to me now i understand everything see look at your face the way your eyes are angled the way your face is floating that is a crazy face <laughs> mono kid seems he's like he's really out of it is this what happens when you drink too much honey Bedtimer sign. It's the last night time ever, huh? No, it won't be our last night time ever. Just our last night in this horrible place. Tomorrow night, I'm getting out of this place with everyone else. Yeah. Yeah, we promised we would all be friends once we got out. I hear the kids these days don't even say thank you anymore. Blame your... The, I blame the parents. I have properly taught them the true meaning of thank you. It is important to express gratitude to someone who has done something for you. It'll make a person feel happy and they might do something special for you later. In other words, thank you isn't just about conveying gratitude, it's also conveys the expectation of a favor in the future. The more you say thank you, the more you can use people around you. It's always, so always say thank you to the people and make them do lots of stuff for your benefit. Jesus, Monokuma. If you say thank you, then people will actually just bow down to you. It's like, yes, yeah, totally. That's not what he means. Right? Rise and shine, or shine. It is now 8 a.m. My heart's racing. Well, today's the day the time limit expires. My heart is pounding with Don't excitement. Worry. Don't worry. Even if I end up in hell, at least you can be proud that you didn't do the killing. The game. hell you say? You're assuming that they're going to hell. <laughs> this is in you, and you are. You 16 are the who to leave and come as the humans. Uh oh. Hey, Mono Kid. Why don't you go over there and drink some more honey, okay? So long. Farewell. Oh, jeez, Monica. Our Mono Kid. The time limit was set to expire tonight, but weirdly enough, I was looking forward to it. Even then, I barely slept the whole night. I slapped my cheeks and then leaped out of bed. All right. All right. First, I need to go to Suichi's room. We're going to catch the mastermind together. And that's what we're going to do in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Danganronpa V3, Killing Harmony. In the next episode, we will be talking to Kaz... What the fuck did I just say? We are not talking to Kazuichi. Jesus Christ, why the fuck did Kazuichi's name come out of nowhere? We're going to talk to Shuichi. Jesus. Dude, that was like the worst. Anyway, thank you guys again so much for watching. We'll I'll talk to Shuichi next episode. I am mad at myself. And will be mad at myself in the next two hours because that's when I will be picking this game back up. But my golly gee Whitakers. Love you all and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! <laughs>